Hey guys, this is the Masked Man 666 with a let's play of loading. Nicholas? No. Studio Pixel, wrong again. It is Cave Story. Um, now, this was a request from a friend who's having trouble with Cave Story, so. Cave Story! Now, I don't know why, but when I bought the game, which. I, I have this game on the computer, but I bought it on the Wii for controller, as well as just to buy it on the Wii. Don't judge me. Um, for some reason, I have every all this stuff unlocked when I bought the game, but we're just going to be doing the normal story mode. Apparently, I already have a save file. And we're going to do this on the original mode. And someone's transmitting something. Battle Network? No. Kazuma and Sue. Hmm. Escape what? Without any... Okay, you have a computer and a teleporter. I believe those counts as some things. You're also sitting on a chair, are you not? How do you have nothing inside? Well, see, usually if the little symbol says she's offline, she's not going to respond to you. Um, so anyway, anyone who does not know Cave Story is a side, a 2D side-scrolling shooter. Well, not side, I don't know. It's a pretty cool game. You can save with the little floppy disks. I remember when I had to use floppy disk to save. That was a long time ago. And these things, the monitors, refill your health. So anyway, the first screen has nothing to kill you, but the second screen has DEATH SPIKES! Now these only do five damage, but considering you only have three health, yeah. Anyway, um, I'm not bad at this game. I did that on purpose. Aw, oh, darn it. We have no weapon. How can I call it a 2D side-scrolling shooter if we have no weapon? Well, we have Metroid music. Fanfare! Okay, the... Okay, in some points, I like the music in this game better than the one on the computer. Um, but I like the fanfare and the dialogue better on the computer version. They really just messed up the dialogue. They did. I was angry about that. I was also angry that Curly's story is not different from the main story at all. You're just playing as a different character. You don't even start off with my favorite weapon, which I won't be able to get, unfortunately. I'll probably show it off, but I'm not actually going to keep it, because this is going to be a go to sanctuary, or hell run. And the my favorite gun is not suited for the hell run. It is not. Not even close. The worst possible gun for it. <laughs> hey, look. Now you have connection. Does Sue not know how to log off, or does Kazuma not know what offline means? And this dude is meditating? He's probably just sleeping in his armchair or something like that. So we get a weapon. That it? It goes what? Like four blocks? Four blocks. Really? How? It must do a massive amount of damage. One damage. Ow! Jeez, I'm bad at this game. Okay, now, um, those yellow triangles are, I want to say force gems. No, they're basically power-up crystals. See, in the top left it is, there's our gun. It has a level in our health. Now, as the bar fills up, we'll get, it'll level up. It can level up to, up to level 3 each time getting stronger. Now, every single time you get hit, 
you lose. Like, you don't drop the gems, but your XP bar degrades. So, it means that your, a, um, your levels are not permanent. If you're bad at this game and just run into everyone, not only will you die, but you'll have severely degraded weapons in the end. So that's never a good idea. And unfortunately, since I lost that one health, I don't have the luxury of being hit by the spikes. Let's see. Refills your life and saves the game. Even though I shouldn't be. Whatever. You know what? It's the first episode. What do you guys think? Oh, hey, look, a door. Let's just take out of these enemies. See? See, if you saw that, my XP guard degaged. And there's nothing wrong with this door. No, there is. Do not go into the door. It is a trap. I'm pretty sure that's what killed me the first time I ever played this game. Yeah. Um, it's a beginner's trap. Just be careful. You can see if you're going slowly, but if you're rushing, you'll run headlong into it. And I'm pretty sure it hurts. Wait, you ate a cockroach? <sighs> I thought you said there's nothing in there. Does that mean there's no cockroaches or anything at all? Just open the door. There's a door there. What's your problem? Okay, what's going on here? Sue again? Who the heck is this Sue? Toriko. Um. Whoops, forgot to read. Um. Yeah. Good day. Delayed reaction much? Um, actually, it would make sense. Sort of. Um, wow, it took me this many... Ch Never mind. You'll, you'll know why they basically ran and quivered in fear once we fell later on. There's only six of you left? Sue's not one of you. Who is Sue? Answer me! It's a simple question. Um, I guess I haven't explained the controls yet. Okay, now, um... If you're using the Wii controller, it's the control stick. Down is to examine, up is to up, left and right, and also down if you're in the air is to aim. Um, what is it? The two buttons jump and the one button shoot. Um, now I'm using a classic controller, loaned by another one of my friends, so I'd have an easier time, so I wouldn't do that accidentally all the time. You'll see what that is later if you don't already know. So. In the classic controller, of course, B and A is to jump. The control sticks is the control sticks. The L and R is to do what you'll find out later, if you can't tell already. Um, and the Y and X is to shoot. I don't know why they didn't have the B shoot and the A jump. That would be too easy. Now, we're in a game. Um, now, over here, there's one of the other six villagers. And a fish that will actually cause damage, but can't attack. If you run into it, you'll take damage. Sue, Arthur's house. Hmm. Huh, I wonder where she came from if she fell into the reservoir. She hates everyone in the village? That's... I hate people who are like that, even joking. But, um, enough about that. If anyone knows what I'm talking about, if not, it's probably for the better. Don't talk to him again. Shiny! Oh no! Water physics, take hold! We can't jump as high! We're going to drown! Wow. Run for it! Die, fish! Um, the fish won't give you anything, ever. Um, there's not a chance that a normal monster that can give you items, there's no chance that it won't give you items. It'll either give you XP, health, or something we'll be figuring out later. Um, I don't think it's been mentioned who this dude over here, who keeps getting run over. Don't underestimate him. 
Why? We have no idea. Just do as the man says. Don't underestimate him. Saving. So, this is a really fun game. Um, if you're cheap, you can easily get it on the computer, I think. I mean, the copy I have is old, because I got it a long time ago. So, now, this is the farm. Huh. So, to Mamigmas, um, it's probably Mamimigas, but for some reason I call it Mamigmas. Ah! Now I can't even pronounce it. Shush. I'll call it whatever I want. I'll change during the entire video all that I wish. You can't stop me! Um, not red flowers. What's wrong with red flowers? Blood pressure skyrockets? And you'll die in an instant. Okay, why would it matter about your bl Oh. The red flowers are evil! There's blue flowers, yellow flowers, white flowers, and heart flowers! No, this is another life capsule. Which. capsule. Uh, <laughs> ignore my weird pronunciations. Um, if I haven't mentioned, you pick those up, get more health. Now, the more the more. The more the more the more game goes on, the longer the game goes on, the more and more they'll be worth. It's not that ours that we currently have will suddenly be worth more, but the newer ones that we pick up later on in the game increase by, I'm falling, increase by a greater amount. I think up to five or six. Hey, look! What were you doing? Eating? Flying dragons? A dragon that flies in the sky? <gasps> I've only seen the ground-bound dragons. Haven't you guys? Okay. Um, I don't get what... <sighs> There's something special about these dragons. They can fly! What? I don't get what's wrong with this world. What's this? Author's house. Oh, let's go see Sue. Oh, it's locked. Maybe, nah, that's probably not it. We might as well ask that Turico person if that key that um the other M Mimi guy is looking for is the one to Arthur's house. Assembly Hall. Is this like the town hall? Fire. There's something on the other side. A very important item, which we will get later on in the game. Oh no, mushrooms, because mushrooms are deadly and you can't just burn them or something. What's so deadly about mushrooms? Jeez. And why is, how is that open door stopping the mushrooms from growing outside? I don't know. Okay, here is our second item, or fourth if you count the life capsules. The map system. Press the minus key and you see a map. Not all that useful if you've already played the game. Like me. This game is not too complicated, but... Eh, watch out. She will rush you. You just have to hit her once. Then talk to her. Um, do I look like a doctor? Okay, by the way, something important to mention that will be mentioned later, but I might as well mention it now. Our protagonist has amnesia. He has no idea who he is, what he is, where he is. So, he's just as clueless as the people who are just joining my videos. Why are you just joining it now? Go back to the beginning. Hmm. King, is that that... Other Mimigma? Mimigma? Shut up. I'm sorry. Um, <laughs> Huzzah! It's Balrog! 
Best enemy in the game! And misery! Yep, they're with the doctor! Oh, wait, she's not Sue. Bubble attack! Okay. Um, yeah, so. Balrog is awesome, and the reason I shout, I shall shout huzzah whenever he enters is because that is the one most thing that annoys me about this game, that they changed Balrog's entrance from huzzah to oh yeah, which is not as nearly as good. Um, yes, you have to clean up. Now, you don't actually have to fight Balrog. I will. Um, because he gives you XP when he, you kill him. Five, to be precise. Now, there is a five XP gem, which is... Son of a... Get off me! Don't hug me! This is a no-hugging zone, Balrog. Um, five... Son of a... <laughs> I'm bad at this! Okay, I usually never get hit by him. What is wrong with me? Son! Ah! Error! Does not compute. There we go. Done! That was terrible. Yeah, but there is a 5 XP gem, but he just gives us 5 Shrey XP. And I lost XP for that. Sad face. Turn my head in shame. This has been the Masked Man 666, and I'll see you in the next part of... Not Paper Mario. Um, Cave Story! Yes! In the next part of Cave Story. Bye for now.